Hey, y'all. Good morning. Happy Thanksgiving. This Lady D live from Detroit. Excuse my attire. It's hot in the kitchen. I'm making my desserts. My dinner is done. Like and subscribe my channel and jump on this bandwagon because what I'm telling you. Hey, y'all. Arrest warrant has been put out for Dejanae Jackson. I ain't going to say not winner, but I'm hearing for both of them. But they gonna, the dominoes going to fall, y'all. They going to fall. Don't even worry about it. It's early, y'all. People still sleep. I'm up early cooking, trying to enjoy smoking, sipping a little bit. Yeah, it's early, but you know you nibbling and eating while you're cooking. Now, let's get to it, y'all. First, okay, <laughs> they got a rest warrant. That's a step towards they going to do something, y'all. That's how I feel. But anyway, check this out, y'all. Um, We're going to take this shit all the way back, and we're going to bring it all the way up to current. Okay, they left Friday. They got there. You know, they did a few events inside the villa. You know, they ate. Play games. Okay, now, everything was good. Even Winter said it. Up until they said Shanquilla got drunk. I don't believe that. But let me tell you, she got drunk. But let me tell y'all what happened. She did some fucked up shit. That's what Winter said, y'all. Winter said she did some fucked up shit. And let me break it down. Because it's finna come out. It's, and y'all gonna say, that damn Miss Detroit told us. But anyway, because I'm a little blogger, I ain't got a big platform, so it's going to take a minute for y'all to see my shit. Period. I ain't in no competition. I get Rahus and shouts out to everybody on here. I'm not a hater, and nor am I jealous, okay, about nothing. I'm living a good life with my kids and my family and friends. Now, thank God, you know, I ain't around the type of motherfuckers that want to get you for what you got, you know. I worked hard for whatever I got and saved my money up and was determined. Okay, let's get to it, y'all. Enough of me. Anyway, okay, Friday they got there. Now, Jazir wasn't there, and Jazir ain't her motherfucking best friend. Khalil is, okay? Khalil is her best friend, not Jazir. Jaz okay, let me break this shit down for y'all how it really go, okay? They live in the same town. They went to the same college. Shanquilla knew Khalil first. Khalil introduced her to Malik, Dejanay, Winter, and Elise. Okay? When he introduced her to them, they became cool, but she didn't really fuck with them. Them wasn't her friends. Y'all got to understand that. Them was not her friends. Them was friends through friends through friends. Okay? So, trust, caring, and concern wasn't with them hoes. Excuse my French. They wasn't with them. They didn't like her. They was jealous of her. Okay? Because around the time of the pandemic, all of them got their little PPP loans. Okay? That girl braid hair without a PPP loan. Okay? Let's, let's say that. She was braiding hair without a PPP loan, okay? And doing damn good at it, making good money, started her own business from there, okay? They said she drove an hour and a half away once a month to braid little kids' hair, okay? That was her hookup, her grind, okay? They shit failed. Hers kept going. <clears throat> you can see in the video where he said he need to get on her payroll. She said, I love you. Nigga, I'm not fucking with you on my money line. Oh, no. Because the minute you bring a nigga in, be that same nigga that take over your business and do you fucked up and dirty like Damien Dash and Jay-Z, allegedly. But anyway, um, okay, Friday. They having a good time. You can hear in the video, where y'all hoes at? They was, she was plotting then. On um, building up a way to get her. I don't care what nobody say. That's what it seemed like to me. That's my opinion. Okay. She was building up her adrenaline then. Okay. It didn't happen that night. They had words that night because after the, while they was drinking and playing the games, they was fucking with the tablets and the phone. Her and the people that was playing some type of game, they was playing online. Go back and look at the video. You will see it on the phone. The 
her second phone. That's also on the table and the tablet. Go back and look. They was playing some type of game. You play online and it tell you what to do. That's why she said, uh, Winter, you and y'all didn't have no upper body strength, Dejanay. Come on now, Winter, Winter. Yeah. Okay. In between that little time zone and them going to bed, Shanquilla got into it with Dejanay. Okay. And let me tell y'all why. Because during the time they was playing that game, she was working three devices. She got two phones and a tablet. And you could hear it coming off the Bluetooth. Okay? Ride with me, y'all. You could hear it coming off the Bluetooth. They at the table. She's the one saying, drink, drink, drink up, y'all. Okay, but let me go back. When they first must have sat down at the table, you hear Khalil say, um... I want to give a toast because don't nobody do it the way we do it. And if they ain't doing it the way we doing it, we fuck them or keep going or something. And they all toast it up. Couldn't catch the end part, but okay. That's her saying, drink up, y'all drink. Not them telling her and making her drink. She just having a good time saying, drink up. Okay, now in between, after that, they start playing the game. The video popped up on that tablet or that phone, or he seen it in her photos. Because, mind you, they was playing games. And she was fucking with all three devices. After that, they mood changed. Okay? Had to. It's just what I'm assuming. Okay? But, and it's been said. Okay? She do a lot of walking around with her phone when she on her trips. She having fun recording how he eating with her family. She supposedly stumbled up on them two getting busy and recorded it. Now, the reason her man wasn't a fear of her going out of town with them because they fags. Okay, that's in his book, they're gay. Excuse my no offense toward the gay community. None at all. I love them to death. Um, she caught them in a compromising position. And when they was playing that game, it popped up. And Malik told Dejanay, who was his best friend, to get that hoe, okay? When she first confronted her about it, she said, fuck this trip, let's go, we leaving in the morning, okay? Which would have took it to Saturday, okay? So the shit had to go down Saturday, okay? I'm telling y'all, I just got a vibe that that's how it went. And from the bits and pieces I'm fitting together from the videos, them, other people, that's what happened, okay? After that, the argument, she went up to her room. She was in the main suite. She went up to her room. She was sleeping in the bed. Winner said she woke her up and told her, get out the bed or I'm going to drag you out. And the fight went on after that. Okay, that's what we see, her assaulting her. So everything I'm telling y'all got to make sense. It got to fall into place now. Come on. Now. Pink hat and all. <laughs> but I'm on it. Now. In her damn death certificate, it say 3 o'clock, 15 minutes later, she was dead. Now, let me tell y'all something. I believe that's the real deal. Anything after that is fake as fuck. Because, mind you, 17000 was gone out of her motherfucking bank account. And them Mexican motherfuckers is money hungry for United States dollars, okay? They love to get their hand on American currency. So they offer, look, just say this, da-da-da-da-da. Paid the bitch, and she swiped the card and stole her some money. She ain't no way no doctor, certified motherfucking doctor, went to that scene and seen that girl's condition and didn't know that she was fucked up the way she was. I don't care what nobody say. If you got a motherfucking medical license and you practice doctorism for your life, you had to get there and see that that girl fucking face was beat the fuck up because that girl was hitting her like two men's in a motherfucking boxing ring. So I know her face had to be visibly fucked up. So they can go on with that bullshit, y'all. I don't believe that shit. I don't believe that shit at all, okay? So I think all that shit is corrupted from them to the nurse, to the doctor, to the police. Period. That's the only way to put this shit. 
Okay, and from there, they came with the cockamamie ass and they rolled with that fucking alcohol story. They convinced the EMTs, paid the doctor, paid them to pay. It's too much money being paid for 17000 But over there, them some money-hungry motherfuckers. I ain't trying to be funny. They will do anything for the dollar, the United States dollar. Okay, so all of them probably was paid, but they under investigation too. This lady D live from Detroit. And I just had to break that down for y'all. They making conflicting motherfucking news stories, police reports, time stamps. It's fucked up. I hope and pray she really do get justice, y'all. That was just some bold ass shit. But this lady D live from Detroit, I said enough. I'm trying to tell y'all, fit in the pieces. Keep digging. It's going to come out because now they, the dominoes from the fall, y'all, have a blessed Bless, bless Thanksgiving. I'm out.